Hi everybody, Danielle here at Girl Racer Scrap, and I am back. Um, I haven't had a video in, oh, I would say, over a month or two, maybe. Um, I have had some problems with my iPad being, like, the storage is full, and I delete videos and stuff, and it still says I don't have enough storage, so I'm still trying to sort that out. Um, I don't normally like to record on my phone, but this is what it's resulting to. Um, not that the quality's bad or anything, I just don't want to clog up my phone with, um, these kind of things. So, I'm gonna get this out there, because I miss YouTube. I've been watching everybody, um, regardless, uh, even though I haven't been posting myself. So, I'm just gonna get to this, um, this is a somewhat recent Joann's haul, and this is the Black Friday... Um, lawn Vaughn haul that I did that's been sitting on my desk waiting to be put away. Um, so even though this is old news here because I'm sure you've seen a million of these hauls already, um, still feel like I want to show it to you guys. So um, we will start with the Joann's haul first. Since I haven't been to my Joann's in a while, it just has been kind of eh. Um, but I always go back and check my clearance aisle and it was actually really good. Um, tons of Heidi Swap and what was the other stuff? Uh, Teresa Collins. Tons. Both, um, both ladies stuff was back there and I know all this stuff is extremely popular right now. Um, I just don't like paying full price. So, um, I'm going to get to it. This was $2.97. This is the Heidi Swap. It's a roller date stamp. So it's from 2014. And yeah, we all have roller date stamps, but this one has the months in her handwriting. So yeah, I fell in love. So it goes from 2012 to 2021. And then there's also a 20 blank. So you can fill in the future. So I hope I can get these to stamp well. I never have luck with roller date stamps, even though I continue to buy them and I have a stash of them. I just can never get a good impression. These are also $1.97. These like, uh, I don't want to call them binder clips, but they are clips. Not sure my plan for them, but I thought they were cute. They kind of have just a dab of paint on them. This is the Teresa Collins gallery cards foil it says create a beautiful life I don't know what the lot what the line is so just in case you need to see which one it was there was several packs of um, clear cards regular cards and I just decided to get one pack because I already have enough project life cards that I don't use <laughs> that I just want to do one and I kind of liked the sayings of this because I've been working out and losing weight and I thought these would be good with doing that and I've started to run some 5k's run <laughs> who am I kidding walk <laughs> with a little bit of jogging so um I thought these would be good like be a warrior the 100% so I will go through these really quickly and these are obviously old. Oh, and these were $4.97. So I'll go through these really quick. And again, these are transparent. Let's do this so at least you have something to shine. And you get two of each, like they said. Just not a bad example. Just these are just white plus signs. Two of them. You get hashtag fearless just on clear so that would look good on like over a photo would be great dream big with white paint smooshy you are gold um just a white black and gold geometric design a little odd just a gold frame so you can put this over a photograph Ooh, there's only one of those. Let's see. Maybe it was shelved around. Since these were in the clearance zone, um, I don't know if, like, they were gone through and somebody put extras in a 
pack and checked out so I didn't count so it's all right though um, two of these fat gold stripes two gold numbers one through nine I guess don't know really what you do with that gold pie chart with a black wedge with a heart in it these are all four by six a white um, like sunburst I guess the I did get two Bia Warriors in white, 100% in black, and two Never Forget White Elephant with black writing. There's two there. So I was gypped a gold frame, but I'm not going to cry, they were already on sale. Maybe if you go, just double check your pack, because there's definitely enough room in this pack to shove some in from another set and out of the store so there's that this is the Heidi Swap stamp and stencil set so this is the stamp part that says this moment with a triangle don't really care about the stamp too much um, but even for $2.97 I thought the stencil was a good deal so again 2014 doesn't really say what like line it's from this is Heidi swap this is, was a embossing folder for $2.97 and it's just these fat lines that I'll emboss so I thought this would be different $1.97 these are this is like a foiling kit so these are like thickers that have glue on the top so you would peel this off and then you would put the gold foil sheet over them and rub it and then pull the gold off and then these will all be gold why they just don't sell them to you already gold i got no clue it'll save some time so but i guess if you didn't want to use the foil you could glitter them or use another color foil if you already own foil so got that and this again was 297 another stencil so and stamp kit so there's the stamp thought the stencil was more my style here with these wonky triangles but the, this is its stamp is cute I just don't know the kind of quality if this is photopolymer or just acrylic so I'm banking it's acrylic so so that was Joanne's Heidi Swap with a little bit of Teresa Collins but there was a lot more Teresa Collins there on to the Lawn Fawn Black Friday. Long story short, I was sick during Thanksgiving. I had the stomach bug that's going around and I slept through Black Friday. So thank goodness Black Friday sales went all the way to Monday. <laughs> They're gonna have to rename it Black Weekend or some <laughs> Black Holiday, I don't know. So thankfully by Monday I purchased this order because I saw where if you purchased so much you got this little guy for free so i'm sure you've already seen this little guy he is stinking cute just like he's named and if you spent even more money you got matching dice set but i didn't want to do that kind of damage so got that when you order directly from mon fawn you get a little freebie thank you and this says gracias with a happy face so that's cute I picked up some wood veneer pieces. I don't have any of these, and I was trying to make quota, so I was like, what the heck. So I got hugs, the stars wood veneer. So some of this was in the clearance area. I got the, what they call hearts. Thanks. I got the happy fourth set. I really have this weird feeling that I already own this. But we'll see. Um, but I always love everybody's cards I made with it. And I was like, I need this in my life. So, got that. Uh, was on clearance. And this one has been, like, on my wish list for a very, very, very long time. And I knew it was retired. And I thought it was all gone. And I was going to have to get it used somewhere. And I never did. So, this is, like, one of the very first stamps that Salon Fawn did. Um, before they were so big. It was swimsuit season. And I just think it's adorable. And heck, it could also use to be like documenting your working out and be like, I want to be fit in this come summertime. So I thought it was great. I live in Florida. 
this is multi-purpose <laughs> all year round. And I also thought it'd be cute to have any of the critters in the life preserver animal. <coughs> I picked up the Lawn Fundamentals, the craft envelopes for the four bar size. And to go with that, I picked up the Walnut note cards. So I think when I need like a quick card, these will be really good and just slap like a little image on it and call it a day. Also great to put a gift card in. Also got some freebies of the 12 by 12 paper because I think they stopped um, selling the 12 by 12 paper. So I'm hoarding my kits from Lanthon. Uh, don't know what collections these are from matches with this, but not off the top of my head, I don't know. I think these are just they're like normal solids and it's like a corally color. And I picked up sweater weather because I didn't pick up the first go because I wasn't totally in love with the colors, but they've grown on me. So I picked it up. I'll just kind of do this because this is old and we've all seen it. But if you're new, here you go. Sorry, I'm not so silly normally, but I'm tired. It's an early long weekend. There you go. Alrighty, so I hope you liked my haul. Again, I'm still promising on getting you some like tutorials and like process videos. I couldn't think of the word, but the iPad down, not that it's down, it's still usable. I just can't record. Um, I don't know what I'm going to do. I had my GoPro set up at one time, so it would record and then I could edit it. But when you take the video from that and put it on the computer and edit it, it makes the process time consuming. When it's on your phone and I can quickly edit it on the iMovie app, I can upload it in, you know, five, not upload it, but I can edit and do my things in about like five minutes and then let it upload um, versus putting it to the computer that's going to probably gain like another 30 minutes to 45 minutes of me toying with it. Um, and I'd rather spend my time crafting. <laughs> so, um, I hope you've enjoyed. If you want, I will do a card share and please stick with me. I'm trying to work on these things. Um, but otherwise, hope you enjoyed. Comment, subscribe, tell me what you like, tell me what you want to see. You know, you've already told me that. Um, but... Go ahead, check out uh, all my design teams that I'm on. Go check out Newton's Nook Designs, My Style Stamps, and Studio 29 Designs. Um, just in case, they might be new companies to you. And we all like new things, right? And finding out new stuff. So go check them out. Um, no pressure. Tell them I sent you. And have a good day. Bye.